Welcome back everyone to Let's Play Fallout 2. We're on our way to Gecko to optimize the plant. The power plant. Uh, so... Let's, let's just have daylight because it's nicer that way. Alright, junkyard settlement. Uh, settlement. Uh, there's Lenny. No, that's not Lenny, that's the other one. Let's go to the power plant. We've already fixed its leak. So now all we have to do is go there. I still can't believe last time when we bought that uh, metal armor that it's got so much less armor class than this leather armor mark too. Or whatever it is, it's actually special combat leather jacket. It's actually uh, special because I don't think you can get this one anywhere else in the game. Um, it doesn't have that much resistance, but 27 AC means they'll hardly be hitting you, which is excellent. Thanks for getting the data we needed from Vault City to optimize this leaky old beast. You're a sly one, no denying it, by Cracky. Almost as good a job as I could have done myself. Of course, if you wanna actually finish the dang job, just use the dead disk on the robot control terminal. Understand me? Well, okay then. Well, I don't like the... the uh, I didn't like leaving the job only half done. Goodbye, Festus. Well, let's go uh, optimize the plant now. This guy will... These guys will also have something to say about that. Hello. Thanks for fixing the reactor. Alright, let's uh, use it. Oh, actually... No, log off. Oh, there's another funny thing we can do here. Uh, where's the disc? There it is. You gained 2,500 experience. The procedure was successful. And you gained 20 karma. Purring like a kitten. <laughs> I've never heard her hum like that. Alright, so, let's save the game. Uh, I'll just show you, there's something funny you can do here. I can't... How do I do this? I can't remember. Station number three, reactor maintenance re and repair robot control terminal. Function? No, it's somewhere else. Isn't that at the beginning? Initialize? Oh yeah, this... No. Function access code. That's not this one. I thought it was at the very beginning and you had to get it right the first time. Action. Yeah, let's see. Oops. Okay, maybe A. Okay. Then three. No. A. What? One more attempt permitted. I said A, incorrect security access denied, internal security procedures activated. That doesn't sound good. What do you mean? I... It was three the first time, wasn't it? Okay. Five, no. A, okay. A, five, and three. There we go. Cleaning, cool, and general maintenance. No. Coolant maintenance. Oh. Unit rollout initiated. Checking drive system. Okay. Checking manipulator arm. Okay. Checking internal stabilizer. Okay. Logic circuits fail. The logic circuits failed. I wonder what that means. Job task location recognition inoperative. Unit cannot is not capable of recognizing movement location of extended distances. Recommend. Move unit to intermediary locations as waypoints to find final job task location. I wonder what happens if I don't enter the jobs in the right order. Unit returns to the bay of command. Program contains terminal errors. <clears throat> oh well, that explains it. Logic circuits damaged. In emergency, unit may be directed manually. But this... I don't want to do this. How... I remember there being something else. No. Oh well. I wanted to show you something cool, but... I guess I've already blown it. Maybe I should have done before repairing the reactor or something. Oh well. Anyway. Let's get out of here. We got loads of XP. The reactor is going crazy now. Because it's purring like a kitten. Let's ask this guy. 
You're back, huh? Take a wrong turn? Uh, I thought I saw people living in there. Is that safe? Well, we tend to like the background radiation leakage here. The glowing ones really like it. None of us would feel very well without it. Background leakage? Well, I wouldn't worry unless you play to stay here for more than a couple of weeks. Most of the radiation that the reactor leaks goes into the coolant water and we pump that back underground. The little bit that leaks above ground just feels good to us somehow. Hmm, I think I'd better be moving along. Goodbye. Of course, that's not true anymore because it's purring like a kitten now. There we go. Anyway, let's go back to Vault City and to that uh, horrible woman who will hopefully give us the bloody stuff we want. Well, Solik is uh, wearing the metal armor and kind of jealous about that but yeah we're a long-range fighter why not he's he's gonna be taking the hits I guess uh, let's go to vault ZD make sure it's daylight because otherwise people are pissy about it inner city yes yes we need to go through this and you will have something nice for us vault city prevails citizen I will have enough to carry it so that's good oh I forgot to go to that guy tell him that uh, the power plant was... Oh. You won't believe this. Not less than a day after you gave me those tools, that super toolkit I ordered arrives. But not just one, they sent me five. What the hell is wrong with the ordering office? Could you part with one of those tools kits? Why not? What am I going to do with five? Take it. I swear that I'm going to beat the living tar out of the list office for this. Thanks. Appreciate it. All right, so here we have the super toolkit. And if you remember, uh, this is what this is. This is also going to help us uh, repair stuff. For example, that uh, auto dock outside. But if you remember, uh, this is also what that uh, tinkerer guy in Gecko wants. And for this, he said he would give us that car part. So, not only that, but we have a fuel cell controller, which will mean that um, the car will use much less juice so that's gonna be cool we're gonna have a car baby oh yeah a car I feel silly now anyway I hope I can already go to mr. McClure here and tell him about all that damn it I can't Ah, damn, I, I guess I have to go back to Gecko first. Bloody hell. Oh. Oh, well, let's go then. Oh, maybe I have to go to Lynette, but I doubt, because she's just a bitch. And that's all there is to it. Yes. Of course. What can I help you with, citizen? Uh, Gek, Volcity, no. Nothing. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Oh, well. Let's go back to Gecko then. There's a lot of uh, back and forth here, unfortunately. But, you know, I don't really mind it. Gecko is such an awesome place. I don't mind going there. Vault City, a little less so, but I kind of don't mind it now as much as I did before for some reason. I'm not sure why, but it's pretty cool. It's okay now. Even though people are still assholes. <laughs> Let's go out through the doors, and uh, we'll uh, try to repair the auto dock with the super toolkit. I don't think you can really use it up, but just in case you can, I'll, I'm gonna save. <laughs> I don't think you can really use a toolkit though. Use it up, I mean. Save. Yes. Alright, use. Oh, there we go. The damage wasn't as bad as it seemed. Some interior cables needed to be replaced and the diagnostic board cleaned. No problem, you get 100 experience points. Now, this is gonna be kinda crappy, but if we go to this guy... You here to get patched up? Uh, what is this place again? This here is the common body shop for Vault City. Me and the old doctor in the back patch up whoever needs attention. Old doctor? Yeah, the auto doctor in the back room there. It's a loner from the city. Been running a lot of s a lot smoother lately. Which is good. Cuts down on repeat visitors. Yeah, I replaced some of the cables and cleaned out the interior. It shouldn't give you any more trouble. Uh, well, 
Thank you very much. That was decent of you to volunteer to fix it like that. Oh, it wasn't a volunteer job. I expect some money for your serv- for my services. And he's not gonna, you know, do it. So, never mind. Any chance I could get some sort of discount? Hell no! I didn't ask you to fix it, so you don't get jack. I wouldn't push your luck as long as the guards are in earshot. Go ahead, call them. They won't get here in time to save your ass. <laughs> well then, you're welcome. <laughs> so, was there something else you, uh, I could help you with? Let me see if he's got something in the bar there. No, he does not. So, yeah, very nice guy. Nice guys all around in Vault City, don't you think? I'm still pissed about that kid. Oh, well. Nice guy indeed, bloody bastard. <sighs> Thankless swine. I'm still so amazed that these turrets actually move. This was not so when I played the original. Actually, you know what? The uh, the last version of the restoration patch was released a month or so ago. I really should apply that. But I'm kind of I'm kind of um, worried that it'll break something and I'll have to start it all over again or something. All right, let's go to this guy. Hey there! You're back with my re repair kit! Hmm, snap off. They're the best. Ready to trade? It's a deal. That's a mighty fine trade. You should be able to just pl plug that sucker in and get your car working. You know, like, do your another favor by fixing up some of your stuff for free, too. Really? For free, huh? What do I need to do for you? Well, you see, I need a darn three-step plasma transformer. And the only place I can figure to get one is from the supply room. Why don't you just get it from there, then? I kind of wore out my welcome there, and it was only a little fire, too. <laughs> Could have happened to just anyone. Anyhow, they won't let me anywhere inside the reactor building. No, I need someone else to get my part for me. How do I get the plasma transformer for you? You just gotta get yourself a supply requisition form. Once you have that, just give it to Jeremy in the supply room, and he'll give you any darn thing you want. You can get supply requisitions from Harold or Festus. Where are Harold and Festus? Harold's in the settlement and Festus is in the reactor control room, but you might have to kind of get the forms on the sly, if you know what I mean. You mean I have to steal their acquisition form, don't you? Well, uh, yeah, I guess so. You might ask them, but I wouldn't put your chances too high there. Well, I'll see what I can find out. Oh, okay, we can do that as well, why not? So now we have the lovely, lovely chip. This chip controls the flow of power into a car's electric engines. Many drivers quickly burn out this chip through frequent rapid acceleration. Still a valuable part to have, if, only, if you only had a car to install it with. In. And yes, we do have one. Which is pretty cool. Survival gear. Can we do anything here? I don't think we can. We, ha we have to go to the den as well. Find wood yet? No, I sure haven't. Uh, not yet, but I'm still looking. Well, I sure do, heck. I got all kinds of stuff here for the right price. Let me see what you've got. Oh, oh yeah. We sold stuff to this guy. Oh, that's very nice. Don't mind if I do. Oh, nice money as well. This is excellent. Uh, anything else I can give him? I guess not. I guess I can give him this, but... Uh, there we go. Yeah, that's okay. Is this the part requisition form? Yeah. I guess that wasn't too bad. I guess I can sell another thing. From Solik. Come on, Solik. Come here. Give me one of the pistols or something. Something not very expensive and not that heavy. Hmm... I guess one of these, but these ones are more... Oh, there we go. That's brilliant. This is what we can sell. One of these, I guess. Or maybe even two, if they're only 200 each. Let's find out. Let me see what you've got. Percy. I think it's Percy, right? Perfect. Excellent. Most excellent. Okay, that's a good trade. I agree. Now, Percy, I have to go. Uh, is this the one requisition form? Request form. Yeah, for what? Doesn't say. I guess this is the one, yeah. I 
think we've taken it. Did we? Let's ch double check. Because this is the manager's office here anyway, so... If we can check. Oh, no, there it is. Cool and free. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, we have the right one. That's alright. Let's go over to the power plant and get that little part. And hopefully that doesn't mean he will be uh, making us... Uh, giving us upgrades because that would hurt because I've paid 1500 for that before that would be pretty horrible I think it's that guy no it's this guy hello there my name's Jeremy I'm in charge of the all-powerful supply cabinet here I keep track of all our stored supplies all-powerful okay maybe not all-powerful but it's pretty damn important what do you want I need something from storage. Well, if you want something from storage, you need a request authorization form. Do you have a request authorization form? Yeah, I do. Here it is. Well, this looks like it, all right. What do you need? I need a three-step plasma transformer. I need a mass-covered three-handled credunza. What the hell? <laughs> I think I have one right here in this cabinet. Ah, yes, here it is. Hmm, not the latest model, but it'll have to do. Thanks. Goodbye. There it is. Three-step plasma transformer. Excellent. I love the sounds of this plasma... Um, of this nuclear reactor. You'd think they got fusion up and running by now, but... I, don't know. I guess technology kind of took a back, back seat when, you know, all the nukes fell and stuff like that. All right, let's go back here and give him that little part. Do, 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 do. Hello. Great, you've got my plasma regular or regulator. Thanks. Now I owe you some free work. What did you want me to work on? I'll tell you how much it would have cost, but this one's already paid for. Ah, oh, damn it. Let me see what you can work on. What do you want me to look at? This long arm here, another one. Skeeter studies your long arm and not slowly. Nothing like having an assault rifle with an expanded magazine. I can fix yours up with one for free. Okay. AK-1112 assault rifle. Skeeter takes the item and looks it over with a weird gleam in his eye. Well, this is a mite challenging. Oh, we've already seen this. You don't know exactly what he's doing, but that weird chuckle means something's good. Thanks, Skeeter. I'll go try it out. Alright, so, now we have the assault rifle with an expanded magazine. A hundred shots. That is pretty damn nice. That is pretty darn nice. What does it use? Five millimeter. Wow, really? Five millimeter JHP? Or all of the other ones, really? Oh, this one. Okay. The jacket's hollow point. Okay. I don't really have that much ammunition, 150, I guess, all in all, but that's okay. And I've just noticed something. That assault rifle was full before, and now he expanded the magazine to 100. And I still have those 50 rounds, so I guess he just gave me free 50... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, I'm forgetting stuff. Free 50 bullets. That's a pretty darn good deal, actually. <laughs> Yeah, we need to go to that guy, the greedy guy, which lives uh, lives over here. Uh, where is he? No, over there. I'm still so confused about this reactor here. I really owe you. Now I can get everything I've ever wanted. All at Gecko and Vault City's expense. Just as soon as I'm ratified as a new foreman. Yes, sir. That Harold's really out on his ass now. Uh, yeah, whatever, Gordon. You roll his eye. Uh, you roll your eyes. Well, I guess I'll be going. <laughs> you just better watch yourself, Gordon. The trip down is usually a lot faster than the trip up. Goodbye. I thought he would have something... Uh, to give me. How do... How the hell do you get over there? Why is there no path here? That is really strange. Wait a second. Is there another exit here? I think, like, there's another exit here I've been missing all this time. Is it? No, it doesn't seem like it. Ah, never mind, I'm just giving up. I don't know where that is. Or maybe it's here. 
Isn't there a manhole here? No. There is not, so we will be ignoring this. Okay, anyway. I will uh, we'll go to back to Vault City <coughs> next time then. So, thank you very much for watching. And I will see you in the next part. Bye-bye.